Welcome, welcome. This is the big project that I've been working on for like over a month at this point, if I'm being honest. And the point of this video is to help close out the chapter of Dying Light and to begin a new one for Dying Light 2. I wanted to do something a little bit special, something I think a lot of players will enjoy. And with this, we're going to revisit something that has always been there for us when the original Dying Light did launch. Whether you loaded up the game once and never played it again, played it religiously every single day, had your PS4 crash while playing and you raged, whatever it may be, you know this song. It's the main menu song, so nostalgic, it's a good vibe and also a brilliant video game classic. And to pay homage to this song and to help out some small freelancers, I went on to a website called Fiverr. Essentially what Fiverr is, talented freelancers hop on, they have a skill, in this case playing guitar, I hire them to do a task, and that's it. For this I asked three people to record me their own cover version of the Dying Light main menu theme song. It took so long to find people willing to do this. We have freelancers in here who have never heard of the game, people that have played the game, and also someone that's now subscribed to me on my YouTube channel. So it'll be interesting to see what occurs. I have not listened to any of them yet, and that's exactly what we're going to do today. But before we begin, we have three freelancers, a $28 one, a $44 one, and a $53 one, which totals to roughly $125. And we're gonna go in that exact order too. All of this was sponsored by Rage. No, I'm just kidding. That's all by me. If you did enjoy this and you want something like this again, you uh 500 likes and uh I'll do one for the following. That's an insane number. Probably not gonna happen, but surprise me. And with all that said, here are the results. <laughs> So when I went about messaging these freelancers about what I wanted, I sent them all the same exact message, and here's what I said. Hey there, I am reaching out in regards to a song request. I was hoping you could make a cover version of this song. It was linking to the Horizon main menu theme song. Preferably guitar, maybe acoustic. I'm going for a vibe that captures the essence of the game, but is also suitable for background music as well. That is a big one. It'll be for my YouTube channel, Oni Zombies. You are the expert here. Please let me know if it's possible. If it is, please have a ton of fun with it and try out a bunch of new things that you normally wouldn't. So yeah, in a sense, I wanted just a cover version of the song. I was heavily inspired by other cover versions that were out there. There was a metal one out there. There was an acoustic one out there. They've all done brilliant jobs and I wanted to see what other people had in store for this. And I didn't want to give them too much limitations. I wanted the freelancers to do everything on their own. I wanted them to try out new things that they normally wouldn't and just go wild with it. And the first one that we're going to look at today is from T. McDonald. I was actually his first ever order on Fiverr, so I'm excited to see what occurs. This one was clocked in at $28, so let's see what he did for us. So if we head into Audacity, do some fancy editing, blur that out, throw some dying light gameplay in the background, snap my fingers, add something else on the screen, and now we have our layout for the video. And now, we will play.
Wow. That was really good. <laughs> oh my god, that was amazing. Dude, kudos to you for your your first order too. That was amazing. Honestly, wow. I was blown away. That was that was brilliant. He did an awesome job with that. I love how he incorporated everything. Just like you can just hear that main menu. Oh, it's just so nostalgic and it's just it's such a good rendition of the original. I that that's really good. The the bar is set pretty high for the other two now. That was that was awesome. T McDonald, wow. Oh my god. And then there's parts where he introduces like the extra guitar and you can hear it and there's like they can hear the chord and the string. Oh my god, this is brilliant. Wow. And then it's it starts out slow and then it builds up and then it just keeps going. Oh my god, I loved it. That was an awesome job. That one that one was really good. I'm not going to lie. I, that that I I was genuinely surprised at, at how it turned out. I'm not going to lie. I I my expectations for for this project, like I didn't know what to expect. I just I just handed people things. I'm like, "Here, have fun with it." And th he did a brilliant job T McDonald good job on it. this was amazing I really do wish you the best this was this was a great rendition for the video I seriously enjoyed every single aspect of this song it was it was, it was brilliant like really I, I can't express that enough this was a great way to to pay homage to the song and to also capture the essence of the game all right so the next one that we do have is from Joseph I don't want to mispronounce his last name I'll throw it up on screen right now but this is him check out his profile check out his account and with his he actually sent along a video that we can go and watch him play the guitar play all the instruments and everything It'll be really interesting to see how he does it compared to T Mac in the in the first one this is the guy who's actually subscribed to me now which <laughs> interesting to see how he feels about this so let's start with his now Wow, that was really good. I, I do know that there's some parts where it might look like he was not playing. 
he, he did tell me that he was doing multiple audio tracks so he had to record a bunch of different tracks and then he mixed them all together in editing afterwards so sometimes it might not look like he's playing but he did play it already and then the power of editing he did what he needed to do Th this one this one it's like more like like electrified if that makes sense like it's more it's more out there than the first one the first one was like really grounded in like acoustic and it, he is using an acoustic guitar but the editing and mixing that he did do made it look like it was a lot more you know i, I was i was really impressed i i do know for him this was i think his second ever order because i was his second review on there and he didn't tell me otherwise if i was his first or second i do like how he did incorporate the video i i looking back at it i probably should have asked the other two for videos as well i mean you had the option to, to pay extra for them his was included so i'm really excited to see the third and final guy because he has like way more reviews than these two these two were just the beginners in the fiverr world and he's been out going at the game for a long time i think he's got over a hundred reviews so it'd be really interesting to see how he compares to the other two but joseph if you're watching you did a really good job i do appreciate it all right so the final one that we do have we have mitchell low and he's the one he's got over like 200 reviews so i'm excited to see what he has in store for us and i know he was going to incorporate a bunch of instruments for him that's the option that i chose so it could be anything it could be ukulele acoustic bass everything and anything could be in here i have no idea but i'm excited to see what he's got in store for us had a lot of instruments in there wow you can just tell that he had like different basses different guitars I'm pretty sure there's a ukulele in there somewhere no he, he did a really good job um in the beginning it's kind of more grounded and then it starts to pick up and, and speed up it, it honestly it kind of reminded me of like the last of us at at some portions that he did have and then like kind of like in the middle it seemed to like drift off from the theme song like I can hear some aspects of it, but it wasn't as present as much as the other two. There's like a good portion like in between maybe like 20 seconds where it's kind of slowed down and then it picks right back up. Honestly, it kind of reminded me of like an Ed Sheeran song. Like 
<laughs> like at that point, like it, it felt like Dying Light, Ed Sheeran, Dying Light. Like it, it, it was weird, but it was still really good. So as for like rating and like ranking the three, I'm curious to hear what you guys have to say. I think I would rate them in the order that we watch them. So T-Mac for 28 bucks, I think he did a great job. His version was was phenomenal. I really do do love that one. The cheapest one was the best one and the most expensive one. Kind of a letdown. I was expecting a little bit more. Like I said, that there was like a, a good portion where I was kind of like there wasn't much going on like the first one he did a great job he incorporated everything that i wanted what i do appreciate from everybody is that they just had fun with it and they did what they needed to do but anyways that is all that i have for you guys today this was just like a little little big project that i've been working on for a little bit i have no idea if people are gonna like it no idea if people are gonna enjoy it so if you did leave a like leave a comment subscribe if you and did maybe we'll do more more face cam stuff. Who knows? We'll see how the path goes to world domination. Huh. Take a sip. But in all seriousness, I really hope you did enjoy the video. It did take a lot of time and effort, and I'm curious to hear what your thoughts about it. Is it something to do again? Is it something not to do again? Tell me. I'm just doing whatever I like on this channel, and I don't know. But thank you all for the support. Hope you all have a wonderful day, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.